Good day. This is Paul Eugene, and I am back with what I call a seated resistance training workout. Well, today I have some hand weights with me, and I prefer that you have hand weights at least five pounds or less. But if you can handle heavier weights, go for it. But if you don't have any hand weights, you can always use a couple bottles of water or perhaps a couple cans of vegetables. Or if not, you can always use your natural body shape. All right? Now, listen up. I'm gonna count down from four, and we're gonna start our warm up. You know, we have to warm up our body. We don't wanna be exercising cold muscles with these weights. With that said, here's my countdown. And four, three, and two, and one. Now, all I want you to do first is take our arms alongside the chair. I don't want everybody to take some nice oxygen in and exhale it out. Take it in and take it out. That's it. Breathe it, breathe it in and release it out. One more time. Take it up, release it out. Excellent, right there. Now from here, I just want us to take our arms across our body. It's like we're giving ourselves a hug, warm up to our shoulders. You got this. You deserve a hug today. Give me four, three, and two, and one now. Hold here. Now, what I want you to do is what I call a seated chair march where we don't move our legs. We just pump those arms up and back right there. That's it. Nice and easy. Nothing complex. I think you got this. And you love it. Give me eight more. Eight. Seven. Stay up tall. Six. Five. Four. Three. And two. And one. Hold here. Now from here, I want us to start to cause our heart rate to start to rise. And how do we do that? We reach up and down. That's it, right there. You got it. Now, reach it up. Give me eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, <laughs> and two, and one. Hold here. Now, you know what came to my mind? I want to work our shoulders and our arms by rolling it, right like this. Just roll those arms, you got it. Again now, give me eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, and two. Let's roll it the other way, reverse it. Eight, <laughs> seven, six, five, and four, three, and two, and one hold here. Now here's what I want us to do. I want us to reach across the midline of our body. And what I mean, imagine a line coming down, splitting our bodies between the right and left side. Where we reach out, we're crossing that midline of our bodies, all right? Here we go, reach across the midline of your body. You can turn your upper torso just slightly, okay? <laughs> Give me eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one, hold here. Now, I'm excited. I'm ready to get this seated resistance training on. So, you grab your hand weights, I'll grab mine, and we're gonna get it going on. Now, the first move, before we do it, I want you to make sure you relax your shoulders and you're sitting up tall. We're gonna do hammer curls, which is up and down, right there. Easy going, palms are facing in. Ah, you got it. Again. 
ladies and gents, give me eight more sets. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more set of eight right here. Come on. Eight, seven, sit up tall. Come on. Six, five, four, three, and two, and one. Hold here. Now, how did you do with that hammer curl? You know I can't just stay there, right? No. So what we're going to do is what I call a clean press overhead, one arm at a time. We go up, down, turn the palms out, and then turn it back in. That's it, right there. Press, bring it down. Press, bring it down. Press, bring it down. That's it, eight more. Push, that's it. Seven, six, five, four, three, <laughs> two, and one other arm. Clean press, bring it in, palms face in front. That's it, right there. You rotate it, turn it in, or we coming down. You got this. Clean press. Again, now give me eight, seven, six, how you doing? Five, four, three, two, and one, hold here. Now bring the weights right here. Now I'm gonna do a seated deadlift. Yes, you're saying a seated deadlift? Yes. Now, see how my weights are here? Watch my move. I go four, three, two, pull back. Four, three, two, pull back. Four, three, two, pull back. I'm getting some of this ab work in here. Just imagine that you're dropping the weight down and coming back up. You pull in from your core. That's it. You want the minimum. You want to actually pull. Here we go. Go. Four, three, two. Again. Four, three, two. If you want to, you can turn the weights in. Palms in. You got it? Ha <laughs> ha. Again. Give me four, three, two. Excellent. Four, three, two. Again. Get some ab work in here as well. <laughs> and all here. Now, how did you like that? A deadlift and a chair. But here's what I want to do. I want to combine this deadlift with a bicep curl and a clean press. You're saying, what? Yes. You know me. I'll demo for you, okay? And four, three, new music, two. Here's that move, I go down. One, two, three, up, bicep, clean press, bicep, take it down, go. One, two, three, back, bicep, clean press, bring it down, again. One, two, three, bicep, clean press, that's it. Again, go. One, two, three, up, bicep, clean press. Yes, again. One, two, three, clean bicep, clean press. <laughs> again, let's go. One, two, three, bicep, clean press. One more time, here we go. That's it. And bicep, clean press, <clears throat> hold it right here, top the ball. How did you do on that combo? I love that combo. In fact, I wanna do it again. Just eight more times. Ready, let's go, here we go. One, two, three, back. Clean press, yes. Again, down. One, two, three, bicep, clean press. Excellent. Six more times. One, two, three. Bicep, 
clean press, up, down, again. One, two, three, bicep, clean press, up. Four more times, go. One, two, three, bicep, clean press, up. Three more times. One, two, three, bicep, clean press. Excellent. Two more times. One, two, three, bicep, clean press. Last time, right here. One, two, three, bicep, clean press. And hold it right here. How was that? Did you like that combo? Yeah, I loved it. But listen up. I want to work our deltoids or our shoulders. Yes. So the move is going to be a front lateral raise, then out to the sides, and then come down. But I'm going to make it easier for us. We're going to raise one arm at a time. We're going to go up, up, out, and down. We can take it hammer curl up, hammer curl up, flip it over, out, and down. Join me. Hammer curl up, that's it. Flip it, take it out, and down. Again, up, up, flip it, take it out, down. Excellent, come on. Up, up, flip it, out, down. I love this. Up, up, flip it, out, down, again. Up, flip it, and out, down, again. Up, up, flip it, out, and down. How was that? Talk to Paul. Did you like that? Now, I'm going to challenge us. When we do the lateral raise, and we flip it, we take the arms out, we don't bring your arms down. We're gonna hold it out there for a while. Uh-huh. We're gonna challenge ourselves. And you're gonna come with me, right? Yes. Are you ready? In four, three, two, we take it. Up, up, flip it, and hold right here. For four, three, two, and one. Bring it down, here we go. Up, <laughs> up, and flip it. Out to the side, hold. For four, three, you can hold it, come on. Two, and one, bring it down. Up, <laughs> flip it. Out, and hold, for four. Three, two, and bring it down. Ready? Again. Up. Up. Flip it. Take it out. Hold for four counts. For four. Three. Hang in there. Two. And bring it down. <laughs> How is that? How's that shoulder? Yes? No? Listen up. I want you to give us a, a quick bicep curl, okay? Like this. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, now, watch. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, front now. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, out to the side, angle. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold. How is that? How is your body feeling? Well, mine's, it's feeling good. I don't feel tired. I have to go over some more. And you're coming with me. All right, excuse me here. <coughs> We're gonna work our back muscles. Those lat pull backs. we go. Eight, come on, seven, work that back. Six, five, four, three, 
two, one. Again, give me eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, <laughs> and two, eight more please. Eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, <laughs> and two, and one. Hold here. How was that? Did you work those lat muscles in the back? Yeah, I know you did. But I want to do what is called a bent over row or a fly. Now, on this move, all you're gonna do is be leaning forward a little bit, and the weight's gonna come up and down, like that. Ready, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, Again, give me eight, seven, six, five, four, I love it, three, and two, eight more please, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one, Hold here. Woo! How is that? How's those shoulders feeling? <laughs> I love it. But guess what? We gotta move on. Now, do you want me to work that tricep muscle in the back? You know what I mean by that tricep muscle? Yes. So we're gonna use one weight. Put one down. Yes. And all we're gonna do it's a kickback. See how my elbows are here, close to my ears? Extend it up and bring it back. Ready? Let's go. Eight, seven, come on. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Again. Eight, seven, six. Five, four, <laughs> three, two, eight more please. Come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it down. How was that? We just worked those tricep muscles right there. Yes, but I had an idea. I want to do a different type of clean press. We're going to use one weight, yes. Both hands be like this, and all we're going to do is press up. Just imagine that you're on a bench. I'm going to call it our kind of bench press. We take it up and down, right there. Press it up. You got it, right there. Press, press, press. Give me eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, eight more please. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one, and four. Woo! How was that? Now I have a, another idea. I want us to work these pec muscles, but I'm gonna give you an option because your weights may be too heavy. So all we're gonna do is out here, bring it in and out like that. But if your weights are too heavy, or if your arms are fatigued, you can just use your natural body strength. Press in and pull it out. Right there. 
Excellent. Follow me. Press it in. Pull it back. Just imagine yourself hugging a burrow. Give me eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one, hold. Now, how was that? Did you use your natural body strength or did you use the weights? Well, there's one thing that we don't always exercise a lot. It's our forearm, which is right here. We're so used to doing this that we don't do this. <laughs> this is more challenging, isn't it? So we're gonna work our forearm. We can do it another way too. You see this, like this? We're working that wrist. So talk to me, do you wanna work the wrist or do you wanna work the forearms? But guess what? It's not your choice, it's mine. <laughs> Four arm wins. Ready, we take it. Eight, seven, come on. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Again, if the weight's too heavy, put it down and just use your natural body strength. I'll show you. Keep going. I'm just gonna use my natural body. Right here. Bring it up. Press it down. Working that forearm. You got it, right there. Press it up. You got it, Lucy. But you know me. I gotta use my weight. Keep moving. And four, three, <laughs> two, one, again. Eight, seven, six, five, last four, three, and two, and one, hold here. Woo! How was that? See, we worked our forearm. Now we can work our wrist. Weight here, right there. We just bring it up, down, up, and down. That's it, working that wrist, you got it, again, here we go, eight, seven, six, five, when was the last time that you um, worked your wrist? You probably haven't, right? Eight more, go, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, and two, and one, hold here. Woo! How was that? We worked the wrist, we worked the forearm, we did the biceps, we did some triceps, we did some backs, we did some deadlifts, we did quite a combination. But you know what just came to my mind? I wanna do a seated chop move, okay? <laughs> We're just going to have one weight. It's going to come here, up, and back down. Right there. Up, back down. That's it. Hold that core in. Take that chop or golf swing. <laughs> Four more. That's it. Here we go. And three. Yes. And two, yes. And one, yes. Now we're gonna go from this side. Take it up, bring it back. Up, bring it back. <laughs> up, bring it back. Up, give me four. Up, three, up. <laughs> Two, up, and one, up, and hold. Now, how did you do? Talk the palm. Grab the other way. Okay? Now, 
I know it's getting close for me to bring us down, but I had an idea. Let's just use one way. We're gonna do a figure eight. We go down, across, down, across, down, across, right here. That's it. Excellent. You got it? Take your time. Give me four. That's it. Three. Excellent. Two. One more. <laughs> Hold it right here. How was that? Now, can we do this one more chest press? I don't recall if we did this next move or not. But nevertheless, we go out, in, out. In, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in. Give me eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and hold. How was that? Now, our time is winding down, but I want to give us one last challenge. It's going to go up and out, or out and up. We go out, up, out, up, come on, out, up, out, up, come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Hold here. Woo! How was that? Well, you can put your other weight down now. I'm going to start stretching this out. So take this right arm up. Bring it across your chest. Left hand hold here. Stretching out that shoulder. For four, three, I love it, two, and one. Now, release hands. Left arm up. Across that body, right hand here, stretching out your shoulder. For four, three, oh yeah, two, and one. Drop those hands. Reach behind your chair. Grab your hands, open up that chest, stretching it out. Hold, right here. For four, three, two, and one. Release it. Take this arm up behind your head. Grab here with this hand and stretch out this tricep for four, three, two, and one. Switch arms and hands right here for four, three, two, and one. Release it out. Excellent. Grab this right hand, stretch right here for four, Three, oh yeah, two, switch hands, here we go. We're stretching out that bicep. You got it. Ladies and gents, release that hand. Arms alongside your chair. Now take the shoulders back for four, three, we're almost there. Two, and one now, to the front for four, three, and two, and one now. Let's take an inhale up. Yes. Exhale out. Inhale up. Exhale out. One more time. Inhale up. Bring your arms shoulder height, palms facing front. Contract your abs. Swoop to the front. Arms all the way through. Give yourself a hug. Rotate on the seat a little bit. Other way. <laughs> Now, hold it right here, open the arms up, drop them down, and guess what? You did it. This was our resistant seated, our seated resistant training exercise workout for today. I need you to grab some water. Yes, wipe your brow if you have to, but remember, you wanna do resistant training at least twice a week with 72 hours 
at least of rest in between. In fact, I don't want you to go past 72 hours without doing another session, okay? Well, this has been Paul Eugene. I had a fantastic time with you today. I want everyone to have a blessed day. Paul Eugene is out of here. Woohoo!